Now before I officially begin today's episode, I want to thank the random stranger who traded me a Heracross on the GTS named Hera Boss. I put up a pan sage last night and uh, let me show you what in the bottom screen. Look at that. Hera Boss. Look at that. Level 33. It's a perfect level and it has the awesome nickname. Look, Boss even isn't even spelled right. That's amazing. Oh wait, he's holding an item. So, random person who traded me Hera Boss. Thank you so freaking much. Uh, I highly doubt that you're watching this video, but oh well. Oh wow, he had a, a lucky egg on him. Let's give that to uh, what's what's his face? Uh, Nitro, right? Nitro. Now I need to adjust the camera because I messed it up trying to look at the bottom screen because I was just so excited. I was like, oh my god, I have a hair boss. I was really kind of worried because I was like, oh god, what if it has like some vulgar nickname or something? It's like my life would be ruined. But yes, uh, despite the fact that we have a new Pokemon in this part, I am not going to be using Harabas. I'm going to be using Nitro in this gym. Because, you know, it just makes sense. Nitro is a ground type and stuff. But man, I cannot thank that random GTS person who gave me a hair across enough. So if you got a pan stage last night, that's just, the, that's, thank you so much, oh my god. Welcome to the Nibasa Gym. I didn't feel like reading the rest of that. Oh well, oh well, let's go. Our fourth gym in the Unova region, and my screen is all blurry. Please come back, camera, thank you so much, all right. My camera does that occasionally. I, I don't know why. I don't know why. Don't judge. It's like I'm trying to sabotage the video. Oh, that reminds me. I'm so stupid. Like, for so long, I thought that Ella Kid evolved on friendship. And so I looked it up on Bulbapedia. I was like, why isn't Chuck evolving? And then uh, it said that he evolves to level 30. And I was like, oh my god, he evolves to level 30. It's not friendship. Uh, like, I was like, um, giving him the the friendship raising berries and I was taking him for the massages in Castilia City and I was like why won't he evolve it's like his friendship should be like way up in the clouds right now and even Bianca said it was you can call Bianca on this game and she'll tell you uh, your Pokemon's friendship and uh, and she was like oh you're trapping I mean that you're trapping you are uh, your Ella kid is amazing and stuff and then uh, and then just, it wouldn't evolve. And I was like, why wouldn't it evolve if his friendship was so high? And then it's like, oh, yeah. it's by level, not friendship. So yeah, I feel really stupid. <sighs> Are you ready? I'm ready. I'm ready, all right. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Ugh. I'M READY! You know who else is ready? Nitro is ready. Nitro has always been ready. Nitro is amazing. Nitro's gonna do, um, Mo's job. You guys remember Mo? My Crocorock? I had him on white walkthroughs? Yeah! Good old Mo. And he just came in here and he owned the Nombasa Gym because he was a freaking sand uh, Not a sand dial, Crocorock. I think he had evolved. But yeah. That's how awesome he is. And now Nitro is picking up the flame. Like, it's like one of those Olympic torch runner things. Like, uh, you know, Mo has passed the Olympic torch on to Nitro, and Nitro is continuing the family tradition of destroying the Mombasa Gym. Yes, that's my, uh, that's my story today. This has been going very easily so far. Next trainer, and then Alisa. I like how they changed Alisa's outfit in this game because you know she's a model, so you know obviously models gotta like change to get like what's hip now because this game is like two years in the future. So you know you gotta change that hip stuff, and so it's just I don't know. So. 
Yeah, it's, it gives you... It's like, wow, they actually kind of thought that out there. Game Freak is they, so, yeah. I'm still in awe that I got that awesome hair across from the GTS. I'm still in awe. And Nitro is level 29. And he wants to learn Dig. Oh, that's a good move. I'm gonna forget Sand Tomb, because you know, Sand Tomb kinda sucks. Just a bit. It has low accuracy. I mean, I, I hate moves with low accuracy. That just... That just makes me so angry, more than anything. Low accuracy moves, because they always miss. I'll give you what you need. I'll give you a good whipping on the bum. Ugh. That's what I'll give you. I'm gonna whip you. Ugh. I'm gonna whip you. Ugh. I wanna whip these people. I wanna whip them. Ugh. Who put her on the screen? I should be on the screen. Come on, I should be on the screen. Look at this. Look at this. The, the center of swag is right here. Oh, oh, forget Elisa. It's me. Yeah, I'm not flying around. Uh, I'm gonna run. Uh, Give a super potion to Nitro, so that Nitro will be good to go and just destroy Elisa completely. This can be very good EXP. Ah. <laughs> uh. You think you're so awesome because you're flying. You think you're awesome. Oh, I'm flying. But guess what? I have rock slide. What now? Oh, okay. All right then. I see your point. Uh huh. You know what? Nitro doesn't care. Nitro is actually blind. So you know what? He doesn't see your point. He can't see anything. I don't know, it just looks like he'd be blind, because look at those weird eyes of his. Yeah. Nitro just looks like somebody that would be naturally blind. Just kind of staring off into space. I've discovered that Pokemon that don't evolve, like Amolga and Sigilyph, give you more EXP than Pokemon that do evolve. Like this Flaffy is not going to give me as much EXP as the Amolga did. Just something that I've noticed over time is just that, so, yeah, that's pretty cool, I guess. I swear to God, if it gets a critical hit. Okay. Oh, I just, I've been dealing with so many critical hits lately, it's just been, ugh. No, not again. See, he gave me 300 less EXP than the Amaga did, so. My point is proven. Now the Zipstriker probably will give me more, because look at that Zipstriker's level. Oh my god, it's amazing. But not as amazing as my old Zipstriker. Oh, he was amazing. I think you're so cool, you get your own music and everything. Go ahead, raise your speed, but trapping is like still as crap anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Critical freaking hit! You suck! Not the critical hit, but the zip strike. Dang! I tried a very good day here today. He gained like five levels in this gym. I mean, I know I gave him like a lucky egg from the hair across. Thank God for the person that put a lucky egg on the hair cross and was dumb enough to trade it to me. Oh my God. I mean, really, who puts a lucky egg on a Pokemon and then puts it on the GTS? Lucky egg is a very incredible item. Volt switch. Uh-huh. I can teach that to Chuck. Yeah, look at that. You're Supreme Overlord. Hey, put me back up there. Put me back up there. Yeah, they're Overlord. Yes, that's me. Bow before me, my subjects. No, I don't need you. Actually, yeah. Uh, give me an escort. Yes, that's how cool I am. 
I need an escort out of the gym because I'm awesome. And I'll see you guys on the next Pokemon White 2 walkthrough.